let's chat about testimonials. You know, a testimonial is when somebody says really awesome about your business. Testimonials are the most incredible way to market your business, but getting them isn't always easy. At least it wasn't easy for me until I created a systematic approach for asking for them. And I learned how to ask for testimonials without sounding awkward or desperate. So let's chat about how you can do the same. When I, I have to take a little bit of a note though. When you're providing an awesome product or service, your dream customer, they're gonna wanna give you testimonials. You're not gonna have to ask for them. They will be professing their love for you from the rooftops. When I first started my photography business, my clients would often email or they would text me after a shoot saying how much fun they had, how much they loved their photos, and how excited they were to work with me. I would respond back to them and then I'd ask, hey, are you okay if I share the words you just shared with me on my website? Everyone said yes. I didn't have to ask for it. It was just in the transfer of the conversation. And then I said, can I use this? 10 out of 10, 100 out of 100, 1,000 out of 1,000 people always said yes. Why? It was easy for them and they already said it. Now let's talk about another way to get testimonials if you happen to be working with clients face to face. When this happens, just ask if they would be okay with you snapping a 20 second video of them discussing their experience working together. Bring out your iPhone, bring out any camera, and just ask them questions, have a conversation, or even set up a camera, let it roll to create what we call B-roll. Stuff of you just working together, and then later you can get audio by simply asking questions. This creates almost no additional work for your clients, and most of them are gonna be really happy to do it. I love getting video testimonials because you can transcribe them into text and you can use them in a variety of ways and we're gonna to get to that in a second. The third way you can get testimonials is if you're not working with a client in person, you can simply ask to set up a five minute call on video or on the phone and you can record it and you're gonna ask them three questions. Number one, how would you describe working together? Number two, what was your favorite part of us working together? And number three, why did you choose to work with me? These three tips are relatively easy to use, so let me know how it goes when you start using those testimonials and when you start asking those three questions. Because then, once you do that, once you get the testimonials, it's time for us to move on to the next step, and that is sharing testimonials online. Once you have these testimonials, I suggest you do a few things with them. Number one, I will post testimonials to my stories and then I'll save them as a highlight on my account. Uh, number two, I will then take the text from the testimonial and turn it into a caption that I can use on Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, or, and or, I can add the text or the video straight to my website. In this short video, I explained how to make it easy to ask for a testimonial and easy for your clients to give you one, and the three ways that you can share them online to market your business. Before I end this video, I wanted to ask, what is the nicest thing somebody has said about your business? I wanna use this as an opportunity to use the comments as a guilt-free brag fest. I'd love to learn more about your business by way of what other people said.